Welcome to Coaches Weekly. I'm CJ Selner here with head men's basketball coach Randy Rogers. Coach, a continued growth for your team over the last couple of weeks. It's been a while since we've actually got to sit down with you, but you had the win over Lakeland, and then the team continues to fight, and there's a lot of growth that's shown, and especially in the first half of the games, I feel like the team's very competitive. Yeah, we're competing with everybody in the league, except for two, two of our games, we weren't very competitive, but uh, you know, the other nine that we've played could have gone either way, and we got to figure out a way to make it go our way. Yeah. Now, there's been some real development. Cougar Athlete of the Week, Jarek Hotwagner, has really come alive for you guys. Rebounding has really kind of swung things around. Last year, that was a big struggle for you guys. This year with him, Rodrigo Nava, and it seems like that's been a real point of emphasis for you guys. Yeah. Um, you know, the games that we were not competitive in, we really did get out-rebounded badly. So it is a, it's a huge factor because we're taking care of the ball. Our turnover margin is not bad. Um, you know, we're, we're playing decent defense, but it's, yeah, the rebounding's big. We're, we're getting Chris Claybon back, too, who's a, who played for us last year in the first semester. He'll start practicing today. So he's a 6'6 athletic guy. And uh, that, that should help, too. Now, talk about Jarek, your freshman. Really just has been an all-around player for you as a starter coming in, really having an impact for you guys as a freshman this year. It takes a while to get used to the college game, but I think he's there now. I mean, you get a double-double, and your freshman year is pretty good. And, uh, yeah, when he attacks the ball, he's a good rebounder. You know, and, and that's what we all need to do. And... I, th I think he's adjusting to the game pretty well. Now, you have a very busy week coming up this week. Dominican tomorrow night, then at Benedictine Thursday, before heading to Milwaukee to play MSOE on Saturday. First, let's talk about Dominican. It really doesn't really need to be explained. It's a rivalry cup matchup sponsored by Northwestern Mutual. And you guys, it's always a battle. Dominican is one that nobody, you don't need a real uh, big motivational speech for. Yeah, and they got two great scorers, Roberson and, and Mayberry. Mayberry's a great shooter. Uh, those guys are really tough, as good as anybody in the conference. And we, we just needed to beat them with our, our team depth and, uh, and, and have a good defensive effort. And, it, you know, they start off great in the league, and they're having a good season. So it'll be a great matchup. Yeah. And I think one big point of emphasis for your team is when you guys move the ball around and are very unselfish with the ball, you guys have made some big runs. In that MSOE game on New Year's Eve, I thought there were, you guys were down multiple times in the game, but all of a sudden you guys got out in transition and started really moving the ball. And when you guys really move the ball quickly and find the extra pass, that it's resulted in very good offensive. Well, you hit what we're emphasizing right there. Is sometimes when we need a big bucket, somebody will do it individually. It doesn't work that way. So when we move the ball, we're a good team, and that, that's what we need to do consistently. And I, we got a lot of assists this year, a lot more than last year, a lot of assisted baskets, and that's, that shows statistically. But we need to do it consistently to get over the hump. Well, we look forward to seeing you guys back out on the floor. Cougars back out on the floor tomorrow night against Dominican. That'll be a rivalry cup matchup tipping from Geisman at 7 p.m. Links to all three games this week can be found at cucougars.com. For head coach Randy Rogers, I'm CJ Selner. Thank you for watching Coaches Weekly.